Welcome to yet another Naga vlog. My name is Cassia and I am taking you with me to Seville again, where we organized an amazing trading seminar on a football stadium. That's the first time in history. So buckle up as we take you behind the scenes of this incredible journey. Our first day in Seville was all about preparation. We visited the training center of Sevilla FC to establish filming locations for our next day's shoot with Sevilla FC players. There we met our old friends. You all remember them from the previous vlog, Beatriz and Gonzalo. Once all the plans for the next day's shoot were finalized, we rushed to the stadium to meet the rest of the Naga team. That's when the real work started. We are here at the stadium uh, to check the location for tomorrow's event, to check the setup, see where we're going to have registration area, where the security needs to be, how many people will fit in, so a lot, a lot. That's the stage where Mr. Talasinos is going to teach us about investment. And we're going to have a lot of fun and everybody will be cheering up and it's going to be great. Over there. You see that? Actually, it's like that. Sevilla is number one. Naga is number one. Sevilla, Naga, Campeón. And just when we thought nothing could go wrong, we ran into an issue. Well, Ben's flight was delayed 45 minutes, which means we need to reschedule the whole day. Two days right now. Where is Salvador? If he flights to Munich today, there's another connection from Munich. Uh, we're going now, as you see, we're setting up the stage for Mr. Talasinos for tomorrow's seminar. It's happening in the freaking stadium. I think it's the first time ever that something like that is happening on the stadium. I'm impressed. I expected less, to be honest, but uh, reality is even better. I'm very happy. I'm full of energy and enthusiasm for tomorrow's mega seminar in uh, Sevilla Stadium. It's Vamo Mi Sevilla. Vamos mi Sevilla, vamos mi Sevilla. Is that right? Yeah. All of us guys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not so fast. We have whole day to get there. So the busiest day of our whole trip has started. Our team went back to the training center to meet with the football players. Through filming those interviews, we confirmed that Naga as a community has a lot to do with football and the values the whole club represents. Papu Gomez spoke about the importance of community, their support and how it is a main source of motivation for the players. Ivan Rakitic talked about what it takes to become successful. Jesus Navas spoke to us about his journey and what it means to be a good leader for the team. We also spoke to Yulen Lepetegi himself. He discussed with us the importance of technology in football and what, according to him, the future of this sport looks like. A lot of interesting insights on this subject were also provided by Monchi, who we met at the stadium for an interview as well. I know, what a day. And it wasn't even close to over. Ben is having his interviews at the moment. So we're taking some pictures. So we have the journalist lining up. We have, we've had some interviews already. We have five more, I think. So going good, going strong. Hello. It's always fascinating to hear Ben speak about Naga and the future of the industry. I'll make sure to link some of those interviews in the description, as well as some other helpful information about the future plans of Naga. But moving on. Even though as an official front of shirt sponsor of the team we came to Seville before, it was Ben's very first visit. Seeing all this life definitely made an impression on him. Mikey, turn on your cam. Ooh. <laughs> Look at this man. You see? Yeah. This is the entire station of this. The people will sit and there the Palestinians will speak in front of the stadium. It was quite interesting for me the last uh, 48 hours. So it was not that easy to come here. I arrived here, then I had a call with the investment bank because of the IPO in the US. And then I had back-to-back uh, -to -back interviews now for the last uh, for hours or something and uh, I still am somehow alive but I think tonight I will be tired. However, we have a, a seminar with 500 people, 400 people here where I'm standing. It's actually the, the stage uh, so I will speak as well tonight. So I'm quite busy but of course I'm super proud. I mean started as a small company like it's a small project now we are like a main sponsor here and they're really cool at Sevilla. Um, it's 
really nice reception and I'm very proud, of course, to see the logo everywhere. And, and, and it fits, the stadium is red and white. But it was time to pull ourselves together as the time came to open the doors of the event. And as soon as we did, there were crowds of people ready to learn about investing. We are in the middle of an amazingly beautifully lit stadium and we're about to start. So we're looking for Salva actually, who's doing the first speech. And how I feel, I'm more excited than ever because it's going to be my first time to deliver this amazing and forgettable seminar in a stadium. Naga is writing history in this stadium in Sevilla. The Alpha Trading Seminar started with a touching speech by Monchi, who talked about Sevilla FC's story and the partnership with Naga. Next on stage was Ben to explain to the audience what social trading is and what is special about Naga. Thank you for being here. I'm super, super happy, super proud um, to represent Naga um, also in the partnership with, with Seville. Monchi and us, we have a lot of things in common. I also like data. I love data. The entire business that we've built is data driven um, and I think we are living in a very nice time where we can use data to have a bit more power and control over our own finances. And then the star of the evening, Mr. Andreas Talasinos, the director of education at Naga, began his amazing seminar. Buenas tardes, buenas noches, ¿cómo estás? Our guests enjoyed the first class ticket on a financial education journey. The seminar covered newbie-friendly trading basics and offered many exciting awards for the active participants. iPads, iPhones, AirPods, and even Sevilla FC versus Barcelona VIP box tickets. If you want to watch more highlights from the event, I am linking it right here. To end the successful event, we had cocktails and snacks for our guests and live music by El Nino Brasas. Recognize this guy? Yep, that's Salva. Our Naga people wear many hats. All in all, based on experience and the feedback of our guests, the first ever trading seminar at a football stadium was a success. So as soon as Ben arrived, we began the tour of the training grounds. We got to see junior teams in action and even met Pablo Blanco. As you remember from our first visit, he's a legendary former player of Sevilla FC who currently is a director of the junior teams. But it was time for Ben to meet the Sevilla FC team at the main stadium of the training center. All those guys that we root for every game were now here and we could express our support and pride of having the Naga logo on the front of their shirts. <laughs> and notice Andreas Talasinos predicting tomorrow's game score. Two, okay, like that. Yes, like that, like that. Two, two for tomorrow. Our day continued with a quick walk around Seville and ended up at Robles restaurant to meet Jose Castro Carmona and Jose Maria del Nido Carrasco for lunch. Ben received one of the coolest gifts in history from the president of the club, and then we all enjoyed a delicious meal. Believe it or not, our CEO and Jose Castro Carmona talked about the functionalities of Naga App, the markets, and even the metaverse. The lunch was great, but the conclusion of that day left us speechless. Here is a little summary of our flamenco evening at the Sala Almoraima. game of Sevilla FC versus Atletico Madrid. We're really hoping for the best result today. The Naga is here to support our team. So let's go. We 
met at the stadium about 7 p.m. to welcome the arriving Sevilla FC players. There is definitely a difference between attending this place on a casual day and on a game day. Gathering fans, music, lights, the atmosphere is literally electric. It was time to get on the pitch and watch the players warm up. Not bad. <laughs> ben, accompanied by Andreas Lalasinos, enjoyed watching the game from the presidential box. I was sitting in the presidential lounge, right? So um, emotions were crazy. Uh, first goal was insane. Second goal, I, I felt that uh, you know there is no one from Atletico here. Uh, and the last last ten minutes with the goal was uh, absolutely amazing. I sometimes forget that I'm a main sponsor. I was a real fan today. Uh, it was amazing, and uh, the energy, the people, uh, the stadium, how they did it. Because in the beginning you were there, it was empty. Suddenly it was full. The lights, uh, the sound. The stadium was really special. I'm a soccer fan, right? I've been into many, many stadiums, but the view I had and and, and the feeling and the, the atmosphere was absolutely amazing. Emotions ran high through the whole game and reached the ultimate excitement when Sevilla FC won 2-1. I'm sure the players can feel our support a little extra when we're watching from the stands. Our invited Naga clients absolutely love their VIP Sevilla FC experience. Congratulations to Seville for uh, winning the match tonight and uh, thanks again for Naga, uh, to Naga for inviting me. So our adventure in Sevilla is over, we're leaving tomorrow but we are Super happy with today's victory again. I don't want to say anything, but maybe Naga this season is a lucky charm for Sevilla. Every time we are here, we're winning. So it was great and we'll see you next time.